And so Catherine Jenkins invited her new friend to her new festival in South Wales. This was to be Paul's first ever open air festival. On the way to the concert, we, we passed my house and it, it felt kind of strange. Um, didn't have time to pop in, but you know, it's the first I'd seen in my house for over a month now. So that was, that was strange. I think it's a great thing for the local area. Um, it's absolutely fantastic to be involved with it because both myself and Catherine are both local people, so it, it's good for the local people to have something to come and support. Um, having said that, there were a lot of people from all over the place that came to watch, which, which was a privilege. I, very nice. very, very nice. I think it was a, a, a a mixture of excitement and nerves. It's, it's, it tends to be like that. Um, but it was a huge privilege to have Catherine come and introduce me and then drag me onto stage. So now it's time to introduce you to my first special guest. I have to say, I'm thrilled he could join us. And this is going to be his first ever live performance. So I love him. He is the star of, of stage tonight of screen and also the car phone warehouse <laughs> like i said we love him i know you're gonna love him can we please give a big big huge welcome to my first special guest paul potts i was very careful not to step on the dress didn't really want um, anything more revealing than needed to be um so you know she had a, a lovely dress on that was flowing right way to the ground and i was trying not to step on it on, on the way but it, it was it was a true privilege to be back at home and perform for the first time. And I've, I've never actually performed in Patalba before, so it was um, a huge privilege to walk onto that stage and be singing in front of a, a, a few thousand people. And you know, I enjoyed every moment. I'm always nervous before I go on. Um, in some ways, that's a good thing. You need the adrenaline, uh, otherwise the performance can be flat. So. I'm always nervous before I go on stage. I chose Cage Alida Menina because it's one of the most lovely arias from one of the best operas you'll, you'll ever come across. I remember when I, when I was in Italy, I actually sat down by the beach and um, translated the words. And there's a huge section in the middle that just makes my spine tingle every time I, I come across it. And it's part of the middle section where Rodolfo's introducing himself to Mimi. And basically, he turns around and says, Two thieves, beautiful eyes, stole all the treasure from my chest. The entry was you just now, and now all my dreams are second hand. But that doesn't matter anymore, because here I have hope. And it's, you know, it's just such a wonderful piece. He's Viva! 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 Viva!
Signore, premeti di apporre per sogni per chi me e per i castelli l'aria. I think Ness and Dorm has become my signature tune. Um, it's it's a big aria and, and a big sing, and I I I, I really do enjoy performing it, and and um, I'm glad that people get pleasure from it. <laughs> 